Welcome to Fret Not. My name's Rob. My name's Colton, and welcome to the Entry Level Metal Series. Hey guys, uh, thanks for tuning in. If you don't know anything about this channel, uh, we have went out, this channel's went out, and we've purchased entry level guitars uh, after doing tons of research that we felt like you could buy at a really budget friendly price that will actually be decent guitars. Mm -hmm. So all you need to do is go to Fret Not One or go to Fret Not Guitar Reviews, either, both on YouTube and uh, get on the page, find one of the guitars that's in a giveaway, like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and then type the words D-O-N-E into the comments under the video, and that puts you in to win a guitar. Yep. Welcome to Fret Not. My name's Rob. My name's Colton, and welcome back to the Entry Level Metal Series, where we have a winner for the Faux Jill FLP90. Hey, it's Saturday. That means somebody gets a free guitar. Yep. And look, if you ain't never been to the channel before, this ain't gonna mean nothing but ta-da. It's back. Ta-da. Now listen, if next week's episode don't come out and I just disappeared, uh, it's because my wife killed me because this is her space. <laughs> I'll let you guys know what happened. <laughs> She's like, but my decor. I'm like, it'll be okay. It's just fret knot. Our decor now. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so if you've been around the channel, we're going to, tonight's the night, we're going to give this away. We're going to spin the wheel. Um, we picked this guitar up uh, for $199 off Amazon. It's by a company called Fogil, uh, obviously out of China on Amazon. Uh, but we've been really impressed with the overall build quality. Now, when we first got the guitar, they had the, and it's still kind of that way. They've got it, the action so far down on the frets that you do get a little fret buzz. But hey, when you win this, and one of you will win it, just raise the bridge, take it somewhere, let them raise the action a tad bit. That's all this guitar needs. Mm -hmm. um, somebody commented on this video, and it was like in the last couple of days, I believe, they had just ordered that guitar. Oh, yeah? And just got it. I don't remember if they said they had a same deal, but they kind of reviewed it for us on our comments, and they mm -hmm. said pretty much the same thing. We said really good for everything up into rock and roll, maybe yeah. uh, classic rock with those pickups. Mm -hmm. And they said uh, they didn't really feel like it was more of a, a metal guitar, but they said they were going to keep it that way, I think, because that's kind of what they play or whatever, so it works out good for them. Mm -hmm. They were really impressed with it. Yeah, no, I think it... Uh... It can definitely get into the rock genre, mm -hmm. and then it, more than likely anything below. But once you kind of start getting into like the metal scene, it uh, it might struggle to keep up just a tad. Well, when we I pushed it, I put it on a bunch of different patches, and those patches are just it, you know set up for stupid high gain pickups. Mm -hmm. So it sounded really thin. Mm -hmm. So we did go back to our um, our chunky EVH patch, just our fifty one fifty patch. Yeah. And that's what we recorded on it. And you're going to get to hear that in just a second. Um, let's see. So much going on. A, A, we have memberships. Uh, right under this video, there's a little join button. Click that join button, man. Join the memberships. Now, we have Slack for the last couple of weeks of putting up content because I was in the process of moving. Uh, we didn't have nowhere to film Fret Not. Yeah. Uh, hence, if you saw me sitting out in the yard doing shorts, <laughs> then you understand the scenario. So, long story short, we think we got that worked out. Uh, the plans for the studio, everything's coming along. It, we just got to wait for them to build it, man. So, a um, lot of stuff going on. Our luthier, local luthier at the Guitar Spa has the specs we're looking for. He's already online shopping. He's going to buy us a body and a neck. And we're going to come in and we're going to tell him what pickups to order, uh, the hardware, how we want it set up, and we're going to take you guys through that whole process, and you guys are going to get to be involved in it, uh, and we're going to build a kit guitar offline, um, but we're going to do it Fret Knots way, mm -hmm. so it should come out really good. We might even do something, uh, you know, with you guys, because when we get done with it, we're going to give it to you guys. We may have a poll. Uh, and if you want to comment tonight, if you want to start commenting or whatever on like what colors, you know, we're just going to stain it. We're not painting it. So it's just going to be stained and it'll probably be a matte finish just to keep from it having to go to a paint booth. Mm -hmm. um, but 
if there's any color coordination, you know, that you think that might be really cool on it, we're probably going to end up with a Strat style body, maybe a Tele style body, uh, but we're going to do it fret knot way. Yeah. So it's going to come out good. Mm-hmm. Uh, our luthier we told you about, we've already uh, commissioned him. Our other luthier that's a couple hours from here, he's really excited. He ordered uh, all of our stuff. Uh, we just looked at a sample of what the wood's going to look like the way we're doing it. He kind of made us up a prototype so we could see a piece of the wood. It's going to be amazing. It's going to look real good. Probably going to be mid-October before we run the first video, and we're going to take you guys with us. We're going up to his place. Uh, we're going to sit down. We're going to do an episode of Meet Your Maker. You're going to get to see him in the shop. You're going to get to see stuff he's built. Uh, and then you're going to get to see the project, and he's going to lay everything out that he's working on for us. Yeah. So we're going to take you through that with us. Now, because this is a really expensive high-gain guitar, we probably won't be giving this away. But what we're hoping this will do is introduce some more people to this luthier, man, because he really builds nice guitars. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what else do we have to talk about? We got a million things. Oh, we have a new guitar coming Monday. Yep. And you guys really better like that. <laughs> this one's going to be just what we're supposed to be doing. Yeah. Um, and earlier this morning, I ordered another one. Uh, it'll be here, you know, probably the end of next week. Um, so we're set pretty good for right now. Mm -hmm. uh, so don't forget about our memberships, man. Join the memberships. It's not much. Uh, we also have a super thanks button down there. If you want to just donate to the page one time, anything you do helps us, you know, keep the lights on. Oh, we got new lights. Can you tell? Yeah, anyway, new lights. so all this crap costs money. Anyway, um, what was I going to tell you guys about something else too? Um, I have no clue. I can't remember. Oh, so... Uh, we're giving this guitar away tonight. Mm -hmm. The next guitar to come up is the IYV. Yes. The one we modded. Mm -hmm. That's got a ton of views and a ton of people are on it. And whoever gets that, man, you, you're you welcome. Because that, that sucker's a monster. Yeah, sounds that's really a good. great guitar. Mm -hmm. After that, um, and that's still on the channel. If you go to the Entry Level Metal Series playlist, all those are right at the top. I moved them back all around last night to make sure they're all at the top. I think there's four or five on there. Should be. And we've got the Telecaster, the SBH HD. Mm -hmm. It'll be coming up after that. Then we have the ST1, the Strat version that we modded, yep. our Franken Strat. <laughs> it's coming up after that. And then we just put up, if you saw it last week or earlier this week, we just put up the uh, Schecter. And hey, I'm telling you, man, we kind of had some little stuff make you pull your hair out trying to get everything together on that little guitar. But I hope you watched some of the shorts. You got to hear him play it in the live. I played it the other day. That little guitar sounds good, man. It does. I like the way that one sounds a lot. Those Diamond Plus pickups come out really good on that, man. Mm -hmm. That's It's not expensive. Uh, all those guitars are in the entry-level metal playlist. You need to get on there and uh, get your name in those. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to shut up. We're going to let you hear this in a mix. We're going to come back, we're going to spin the wheel, and one of you is going to go home with it tonight. We'll be right back. Okay, we're back. You got to hear it in the mix. Yeah. Yeah, you were the guy who played it this time. What do you think? Man, it plays super good. Mm -hmm. It just bothers me that the strings are that close to the neck. I mean, yeah. I love them as low as possible. They just don't need to be touching the frets. Yeah. 
You get just a little rattle every now and then. But now let me ask you this. Now you played it quite a bit, mm -hmm. and you've been messing around on it today. What do you think about it? I like the way it plays. I used to have, my very first guitar was a Les Paul style kind of body. I just thought those were the coolest thing mm -hmm. when I was first learning. And I don't know, maybe everybody did when they were wanting Probably, play, but, probably. But I did, and I found one at, my, at a local CD shop. They, they had about four or five guitars hanging on the wall, and they may have been about 150, maybe 200 bucks. I don't know, but I wanted it. And so that's what I really got my chops in on was this off-brand Les Paul style look. And it really kind of, it reminded me of that a lot, and I liked it. And, and it plays nice. I like it. So how do you feel? We've hashed this out so many times on this channel, but we're not going to keep you guys too much longer. But how do you feel about that if it's in that same price range mm -hmm. today as what you got then for that same price range? This is leagues better than what I learned on mm -hmm. and uh just in terms of sound playability for me is relatively the same um because that guitar wasn't that bad uh in terms of playability but the sound i could tell back then with that guitar it was just sounded dull and kind of lifeless it it needed more right and i feel like this has that it does, and it mm -hmm. just doesn't quite reach into the realm of, yeah. you know, like death metal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but that's okay, because everybody doesn't play death metal, and yeah. we really don't. We step off into that genre periodically in music every once in a while, but it's periodic, yeah. you know? Okay, so we've kept you long enough. We're going to do the do, or the deal, or whatever it is. Somebody's going to end up with this thing tonight. Mm -hmm. So make sure you go out to the entry-level metal series playlist get on every one of those videos that we ain't giving away yet they're free guitars just get on there yep all right i think we had about 40 or 45 on this one that's pretty good what we got here quit okay there it is all right we have a at s thrady thrasher I'm probably butchering that, and I'm sorry. Maybe the S is like an initial, and it's Thrady Thrasher, Thraday Thrasher. It at Thrady Thrasher. You got it. <laughs> at Thrady Thrasher. It is your guitar. Congratulations. You're the new owner of the Fogil. Uh, we'll be contacting you here in a couple minutes on the page. Um, if you're seeing this, if you're watching it as it comes out before I contact you, there is a way to on our page. Just go to the more button on our page and you, there's an email there. You can email us back. We do need your shipping information. Um, it's Saturday, so we don't ship out on Saturday. So uh, we will box this up back in its original stuff. We'll get it all ready for you and we'll ship it out to you Monday. Uh, we usually use UPS. Uh, Monday, we'll send you tracking on it and uh, hopefully you'll have it in a couple of days as long as you're in the continental United States. Yeah. All right, so uh, we've talked about a lot of stuff. Uh, help us out, guys. Please go out on the memberships. Uh, go to the Super Thanks button. Um, if you can't do either one of those, and even if you can do those, man, call all the people you know that's in your phone <laughs> that you ain't talked to in forever and go, hey, go check this channel out. There's a couple of idiots on uh, giving away free guitars on there. Yeah, they don't know what they're doing. They're just giving <laughs> guitars away. <laughs> All right, guys, look, we really appreciate you guys. We're so humbled to be hanging out with you guys. Uh, we're working on a bunch of new stuff and not any of the stuff I told you tonight. There's so much more coming. Um, and hopefully there's going to be a way for us to all kind of collab on some stuff. So we'll, we'll, we'll get into that here really quick, hopefully next week. So we appreciate you guys. And until next time. Stay tuned.